Welcome back, it's Pope John Paul here with another Imperator Rome part for you. And we are on part 14, and uh, yeah, we in the last episode we took a fair amount of land from Phrygia. So we'll hopefully carry up that on into the next, well, into this episode and into many episodes to come. I mean, hopefully we can take another large chunk in uh, another war, and then maybe just left with Syria, and then we can push on into the Seleucids. That'll be the plan. That is the plan, anyway. Oh, my! I think my heir, like my so-called heir who's just died, who's a Seleucid. Oh well, I mean, it could be worse. Um, let's import some in extra. Sure. Oh god, a lot of people are dying. Um, yep, yeah, sure, you, and who doesn't like me then? Therids and the Torskinids. Well, none of you are any good, so... Who's the heir now? Um, that's the wrong one. This guy, Achaeus Seleucid. Oh, he's... He's okay. He's got support of most of the nobles. Can you have more kids, please? Probably not. Oh, well. Um, I could imprison her and execute her and then get another kid. There we go, execute her. <laughs> oh well. Um, I want a young person. Thank you. I'll get you. I've just married the niece of the Bezalius, I think, but oh well. I've now got tyranny, which is also a problem, but hey, we'll get rid of it. Um, trading, anyway, we'd like to trade. I think I'll bring in some, maybe grain, Oh, or stone or vegetables. What am I actually already bringing in? That's a, let's look at that. So we're already bringing in grain, we're already bringing in vegetables, we're all bringing in livestock, um, probably stone. Stone would help. I can bring it from my own land. Excellent, right, we'll do that. Um, so yeah, we've got to wait a while until the aggressive expansion goes on and then we'll probably go to war again. Um, we'll support, you demand you support the air. Both of you. I mean, I'm asking you to do that, but really you're about to do stuff anyway. Um, anyway, I'm going to go to war with these people, actually, while we wait. Attack these guys, because why not? Um, I'll just do that. Get the loyalty. I know it's that's a plot chain, but I don't really care. See, so yeah, if we take that, then um, we shouldn't get any aggressive expansion from it because we have a claim on it. Um, okay, so you died. Um, it's gonna have to be you in charge, I think. Yeah, we've got no one any anyone else any good. Oh well. You it is. Um, so I hope you guys are enjoying the. Okay, no action will be taken, thank you. Uh, I hope you guys are enjoying the uh, Let's Play. If you are, leave a like and uh, subscribe. It's very much appreciated. And uh, hopefully the, we may do another Let's Play after this of Imperative. if you guys are enjoying it a lot. Um, go over there then. Oh, no, you, you can't. We're going to take this fort and then... Um, we can take that fort and then we can do it. Oh, I'll lose the money and gain the loyalty. Oh, so I just have to wait. Go back here then. Um, so, while we're waiting, let's build some more training grounds. Oh, we can't actually build them any places now. And let's build some granaries. Help with growth. Um, call for scission. Um, who's this guy? It's Oh, it's him that's going to die. Um, bring a holy man. Ah, uh, yeah, he died. I kind of wanted him to die because he's a pretender to the uh, throne, so we don't really want him kicking around. Macedon is looking very good, though, right now. Uh, let's see what we are in the scores. Oh, we're top. Wow. I know, well, there's no Rome. Maori is looking pretty pretty beaten up. It's having a lot of revolts. Um, Seleucids seem to be sorting themselves out a bit, certainly in the West. Yeah, they don't have any risk of civil war or rebellion either, so they should be okay. They're dealing with their revolt, which is still a bit of a problem. 
But then there's people like these guys. Yeah, we can... If we get there, when we get there, we'll probably roll these guys over. Kill them all. Um, Can we build any more fortresses here? We could build one here. Only if I could build two, though. No, we can only build one. Uh, Egypt really are wanting to trade with us. Um, yeah, make it, make it peaceful. Right, so now, we, now we've now we looted there. Let's go over there. You go in here. You go there. There we go. We started looting properly. Well, not looting, but attacking properly. Wow, the sluices have stuff here. They, they got very far west before they broke up. But it's all all gone now. They're all dead. They're getting invaded by Parnea as well. Well, not currently, but they have been invaded by Parnea. That's unfortunate. So yeah, when this uh, video comes out, I will be away. So there will be a slight decrease in the amount of videos coming out. Not by much, I think. Like maybe one. one be one less than usual. But, um, but yeah. So uh, I will be away on my holidays. So I'm getting some respite from uh, YouTube and and work. Oh my gosh, there's so many troops invading. I don't even think they have this many. Yeah, they have two cohorts. Uh, poor guys. I really caught them at a bad time, but well, what is their their loss is my gain. And it's always handed over to more land. I know this isn't really like this part of the empire, this part of the uh, world, this like. But if you follow my mouse, it's kind of like this part here is kind of like what Alexander skipped out. He didn't really go for it. I'm not really sure why. I need to need to read up on why he didn't really go for it. But um, yeah, he didn't. He just decided it wasn't worth taking and just carried on. I guess it was because Persia didn't hold it. So he just followed where Persia, the Persian banners flew and just took that instead of... Um, going after like these other independent states probably it's like Armenia up here who didn't really he probably had a treaty or something like that with them who knows I'm assuming a lot of things right now uh, okay we won that excellent so we should just have um, two more regions to take no we don't even take that one excellent well I'm probably going to end the war when we've taken these last few regions I'm going to send you back because there's no... Oh, the civil war in e India's ended. Oh, good for them. Um, I mean... Oh, Olympic Games. Excellent. We can always do more Olympic Games. More trade as well. Always loving the trade. 57 ago. That's very nice. Right, so Super Peace will take this. Or oh, maybe I will get some aggressive expansion. Maybe a little. Yeah, just about six. And we'll get money off them, because why not? All the money in the world. There we go. Excellent. Right. Um, where can we put you? There. Put you there. Disloyal. This is a disloyal province. Why are you disloyal? Uh, Sclepius, the main capital, doesn't like us, so we'll convert. Um, you don't have any freemen. You have a lot of slaves. I might promote some of you guys. Um, brother of Archon. Now, I'm going to stop you. You, uh, fighting because I don't really like don't want you fighting um, let's promote some guys while we're here promote some s slaves um, Freeman um, can we just convert some more guys actually while we're here citizens excellent right I'm just doing generally now because I'm not really sure right is that sending it up or going down still it's still going down but it's probably because Aggressive expansion's really, really high. Let's have a look. Where else hates us? Carissa doesn't like us. And and quite a lot of other places. We'll deal with this anyway. We might as well do this. Um, where's this? This is Andrapa. That is actually one of the places that doesn't like us. So we'll... We will do some stuff there. Um, let's promote uh, Pontian Civil Wars over. Let's promote the tribesmen, because that always helps. Freeman. Um, let's assimilate Freeman. Oh, we got a son. Excellent. So the Antropid dynasty lives on. Where's Carissa? I'm looking for that now. Oh, 
Support my air, you bastard. I have no disloyalty here. Okay, now I've run out of stuff. So, do you are you going up? No. Probably still because of aggressive expansion is ridiculously high. But we'll sort that the province loyalty out in a minute. Um, let's do... For the moment, we'll do blessing of Taish. And if barbarians appeared in Skodra. Well, there's a reason we have an army base there. And it's to deal with barbarians. Um, province of Laconia loses 50. Oh, God. Loses 50 loyalty. Wow. Hopefully, they'll gain that back. Is it going back up? It is. Barbarians defeated. Excellent. Right. And then we'll do... Uh, Tyranny's all gone already. Excellent. Um, we'll do some popularity. I could do have, always have more popularity as ruler. Probably my popularity probably isn't help that I've had like executed my wife, and uh, yeah, pretty sure yeah his wife's oh no his mother is there it was oh no maybe uh, he's only had he's only had one child wow um. Okay, so... Oh, ex excellent. Pontus is now going up. Excellent. Right, so it's going up gradually. Let's check all the other provinces. Make sure they're going up. Uh, going up steadily, anyway. Yeah, the further east we're getting, the uh, more the culture is being um, a problem. But we're sorting it out. Mosaic as well is a bit of a problem, but that's like the most Germanic place we've got. Yep, yeah, these are all loving it. Um... I don't think we've got any Cassus Belli's on them, and we have a truce with Fridges, so we can't go to war with them just yet. And didn't plan on it anyway. So yeah, we will uh, we'll do that. We'll wait until we can uh, attack Fridges with some Cassus Belli's. Which hopefully will be soon. Oh, ooh, some guys just died. They didn't have an office though, so that's okay. We'll have a quick look at the rest of the world. Um, usually, Galicia is, seems to always, for me, expand quite quickly into Sp in Spain. Tarbelia doing very, very well as well. They often like take this sort of region of land and then stop expanding. Uh, more trade. Yeah, Carthage doing okay. They've taken like all their, like the lands that they usually take. Maybe got Emporia and these guys have to take out. Haven't really expanded into Spain, which is usually where they like, you know, Carthage is getting far too strong. If they like, I've seen Carthage go well up here as, into Spain. That I, and I was playing as um, Rome, and that's that was a bit of a problem, trying to get them out of there. Um, these guys, the Gete, are a bit of a problem. No, my son has dysentery. Seek treatment, please. He can't die. My heir. What is his name? Philip as well. Ah, we're going through all the Phillips. We're just having a line after line of Phillips. So we could do more Cassus Bellas on Pontus, but I'm not like I'm with Alexander. I'm not interested in this part of the world. I just took it. I don't know, this part I feel like was quite handy to have. But yeah, I'm more interested in going after the actual known empire. Well the Jure Empire, that's the word. I've got to bring loyalty more to the this little boy. How how lot? Most of the people see him as the heir. Some still don't. We're getting there. When he comes of age, people will respect him for who he is. Yeah, we've got so much money to spend on stuff. Nowhere to put it. Um, put marketplaces down over here. Put some granaries as well. Um, yeah, why not? Um, granary there. And then we'll put a few training camps up here. And then a granary in Pella, because there's going to be a lot of... Yeah, sure, we'll have more trade. Um, I put like loads of granaries in place, because you, like you see here, I've got so many slaves. I might move some of these guys in a bit. In a bit, I'm literally at 99 civic power. I will wait until I get my extra little bit. Yeah, I might move some of the slaves just to uh, 
make space for more because there'll be plenty more coming in from uh, all our conquests. Um, okay, so something oops. Um, we're on culture happiness. That always is handy to have. So we'll do that. He's yes, he's cured. I'm pretty sure. Yep, all cured. And he's the blood of Antripatros, so he gets some good buffs. And um, some guys died. He's the admiral. Oh, he was related to the admiral. Wasn't. Um, yep, put you in charge. There's still a few people that aren't happy that they have no jobs. And we've got a daughter as well. Excellent. What's she called? Timo Clear. Yep, I'm never going to remember your name, but I'll marry you off to someone. Can you just be, be loyal to the heir? Not for like four more years will that like finish doing its thing. Jesus. He must not like my heir. He's just a baby boy. He can't, he's done nothing wrong. Anyway, let's um, fabricate a claim on. Um, I could, I'll do it on like. Phrygia, this place here, Phrygia Invictus, let's find it. Phrygia Invictus, or however you say that, I've very definitely, very much uh, butchered that name, but I'm not going to worry about it, I've butchered most of the names in this. Macedon is just about all I can manage, and Phrygia, and Seleucids, I can manage a few. Most of the main names, just not the province names, that's, that's where we struggle. Um... More trade? Excellent. Take some of that. So when's our truce end? Um, I think it's ended, you know? I think it has. We could go to war. We could go to war. I might do. More trade? Yes, please. What state are you in? 82. You've not got much money, but you've got a lot of manpower. And you're in an alliance with the Seleucids. Well, I'd like an alliance with the Seleucids, please. They wouldn't like. They don't like me. Can I have an alliance with Egypt, please? They don't like me. Could they like me? Maybe. Let's send them. Send them a, a thing. Well, if I attack Aeolia, then um, I'm pretty sure that just brings in Phrygia. Yeah, that would be the way to do it. Well, so I wasted money on. Well, wasted some. Uh, Oratory power and just trying to make Egypt like me more, but I don't care. Egypt liking me is always a good idea. Always good, I guess. It seems a bit silly. Like, surely Egypt would be like, yeah, let's ally up with Macedon because then um, we get we can like two team um, Phrygia. They'd be like, yeah, that's that's really for our game. But no, apparently the game's like, no. Why would they want to do that with you? And no one. I thought Macedon was supposed to be guaranteed by the Seleucids in Egypt during this game, but maybe not the Seleucids now because they rebelled, but maybe Egypt just just decided not to guarantee us anymore. Rude. Um, let's move this army up to here. Okay, they just gave me money. I can't spend the money on stuff, though. Stop giving me money. I mean, I could spend it on building more troops, but I'd like need more marketplaces then. More marketplaces. Oh, always good. Let's build on all these small islands that I've somehow acquired. I could take... Oh, no, I have Crete. I was going to say, I thought I had Crete ages ago. Let's... Um... That province is still becoming loyal. Okay, that's happened. Oh, okay, he's now lo that province is now loyal. Excellent. Right, that's not what I wanted to look at anyway. It's this one. Province loyalty. It's looking good. Um, right. So then this one. Let's put it on. I'll put it on discipline. Discipline's always handy. Um, eighty-two, and they have a lot of spare troops. I kind of want to wait until they attack someone, but they don't look like they're going to anytime soon. Probably be me that they'll attack. Hmm. 82. I'm going to need to bring all my armies across. That's 5% attrition there. Uh, 
So let's bring this other army. Then we've got all the armies available. I'll risk um, barbarians appearing. I can always raise an army and send it there. Um, what I was going to do was move some slaves from Pella. Because I've got one too many. Uh, just a couple. Just, you know, you're just too many of you here. Um, I'll move until I have... I'll keep moving until I have no more civic power. There we go. Right, so we moved some of them. So we, they they lost a few. There's still loads of them. There's far too many. Um, okay, Egypt, why don't you like me? You should like me because I am hap wanting to uh, make an alliance with people. And attack Phrygia with you. Could we not do this? So why don't you like me? Cassus Ballet on us. Oh, I'm sorry. An aggressive expansion's too high. I'm sorry. But an Olympics de um, game is declared. Well, now you should like me more. It's still not going to be anywhere near enough to get an alliance. I don't even think Armenia or anyone like that. So hard to make alliances in this game. It's so broken. I don't like it one bit. Yeah, I'm not surprised you don't like me at all. Like, it's just silly. Like, I now struggle to make a... I make a as soon as you get big, it's hard to make an alliance. It just makes no sense. Um, you're guaranteeing Calibria. Oh, these guys. I'm trying to find some Carthage. You're probably like the only other big people that... Yeah, you hate me even more than Egypt. Um... No. No, I, I'm I'm sorry, but no. I don't don't need um the help. Where was he? He's I just see it. I'm trying to remember which army he controls. No, I'd recognise his face. No, it's this guy down here. No, it's not. It's the guy that's coming all the way here. Oh maybe I can't remember. Ah, uh, who knows. Oh, someone's died though, so let's put someone else in charge. Um, Dianid and a Truskid. Oh god, another one died. And then I just see it there. Oh, that's the guy that's not happy. I'll put him in charge for now. Five stars, okay. It's not the greatest. Um, I just see it in charge. So we've got no Truskids or whatever the other ones were. Dianids. Um, no, it's not how I'm doing it. Oh, I need to get the fleet round. The fleet needs to go here. If I declare... Do I declare for that, or... Are oh, the sluices too bu The sluices are too busy fighting in their own civil war. They can't bring troops across here. How many, also, how many troops do they have? 91. Not the end of the world. I have 181. I could declare war, take Aeolia. I can block Aeolia A A A off as well from coming that way. So, and they have 14. These guys, they have not enough money to build um, too much in the way of that. Blessings of Hades, please. I'm going to declare war on Phrygia. I know I'm only at 26. Oh, Governor died. Sort you out first. Um, take the Dianid so they ha they're happy. Um, declare war for Phrygia thingy. Let me just pause quickly. Um, where's Phrygia? This place here. So you've got to go in here. You go in here. You go in here. You go in here. And then you go this way. And you go here. Oh, and you need. You might as well just go and take that. And we've got another son called Philip. Oh no, he's not called Philip. He's called Cassander. Well, Cassander, you may need be needed because we have a problem with heirs at the moment. Um, yeah, you're doing stuff. Good. So we're at war. Again, with Phrygia. Um, yeah, I'll take the military power. There seems no reason why not to take it. Let's see, uh, Phrygia's spamming out troops now. Yeah, they've just got to 120, 130 from nothing. Um... I might as well go and take that back. 
Um, you keep doing this. Where's Phrygia? It's all the way over here. Is this part of Phrygia? This is part of Phrygia. That's what it's being called now. I can't pronounce the name, so that's what it gets. Um, fort defense up, so we are better with our forts. 38, they cannot match my um, my fleet. Um, yeah, you move to there, actually, and you move there. So, and then you are one of the last places. So, yeah, soon we'll be uh, able to just take all this land very, very quickly. Very, very quickly. I mean, they're marching in here, but I'm not too fussed. I'm also going to move this up navy here. Oh, okay, the Sluices decided to, set, decided to send 30,000 troops just to, like, just in case they thought that we were a problem. You know, they're not worried about their own state and problems. They're like, yeah, it'll be fine. We'll just just kill them all. Um, why can you not move? You would give me that and that. I, I'm going to wait for a better deal then also it's one one uh, level one. Oh, one war score that's the one I got there eventually let the looting be gentle and Gaiden or whatever the, I don't even pronounce this name um, you go there you go there you go there this this army seems a bit bugged out at the moment it's not even there we go Okay, wait a minute, wait a minute. What would they be giving me now? They'd be giving a large swathe of land. I'm going to wait a little longer, see if we can get any more out of these guys. Because I could keep... I just, I'm not even hit a battle yet. I could, I could take these guys. I'm sure we can squeeze more out of them. Um, so that's... Yeah, don't know why it's glowing. Go away. Glowing man. Um, very well... Um, take that. Go and attack there. Go and attack. Don't know what... Why aren't you moving then? There we go. It's because this peace deal keeps coming through. Mine's it. Um, no, I'm going to... I'll take what I want myself. I do my own stuff. Um, well, you attack there. Well done, you do that. It's because there's so many armies moving around now and it's just like, the game's kind of going, oh, no, can't do that. So anyway, I'm going to take this land, I think, because that's pretty good and it's it's fairly a fairly good amount of land. And I, unfortunately, that is probably where I'm going to have to end the episode, guys. I hope you've enjoyed. Um, leave a like if you have and I will come back to you uh, next week with more Macedon campaigns. Until next time, bye for now.